Inventor Thomas Edison created the X-ray machine. Now a Honolulu chiropractor is using a souped-up model to reveal injuries conventional X-rays can't. KG Minan's Jim Mendoza has our story. Thanks, Kiahi. First, a warning. Now, some of the images in this story are a little bit graphic. The device is called a fluoroscopy machine. It is part X-ray, part video camera. A broken neck on the left, a displaced shoulder on the right. Painful to the patients whose conventional x-rays missed both injuries. They were caught on tape by DMX. In layman's terms, I would explain to an 8th grader as an x-ray that moves. DMX stands for Digital Motion X-ray, also called fluoroscopy. The machine exposes the root of a patient's pain. On a really bad day, it's a 10. I mean, I'm in bed crying, I'm popping pills, I'm miserable. Hi, Selena. We're going to take a look at your neck today and see how it moves. Selena Unga was in a car crash. Chiropractor Stephen Maglancy used fluoroscopy to spot ligament damage. Through motion, we can see the ligaments if they're strong or weak or stretched. Now just open your mouth and close. Unga says regular x-rays didn't show her jaw was knocked out of alignment, as were ligaments in her neck. So as a doctor, what we would do is focus on stabilizing that neck, getting her better. What we're going to do is called lateral bending, so keep your arms on the side and relax your shoulders. Hospitals use fluoroscopy. Now many mainland chiropractors use it too. Insurance companies have questions. Is it either an approved medical practice that's widely accepted, or is it something that at least we can ask the doctor and say, how did this help you? Did this help you get our customer, your patient, back to health sooner? These right here, these facet injuries, will refer pain between your shoulder blades. Yeah. Unga says she was skeptical at first, after dozens of static x-rays didn't pinpoint her problem. Education is a big part of it. Now she and McGlancy's other patients are understanding what DMX can do. Now Mr. McGlancy says the DMX emits very low radiation levels. The exam, it's pretty costly. It costs $900. You can check with your insurance company to see if they will cover it. Jim Mendoza, KGMB 90.